Being a Falcons fan is a lot like being a heroin addict. You spend 99.9% .9 of your time wandering the streets, wondering where hope left you. And then in the end, you realize, like a junkie, truly loves sweet Lady H. I freaking love you, Devontae Freeman. We freaking love you, Devontae Freeman. I'm gonna state the obvious. The Falcons lost on Sunday. Life is just an infinite series of losses, and then you die. Jared, let me ask you. If you were Falcons owner Arthur Blank, what would you have done on Sunday to ensure a Falcons win? I'd have stolen Devontae Freeman's DNA, and then cloned like 20 Devontae Freemans, and then had a whole field populated of Devontae Freemans to beat the crap out of the Buccaneers. Precisely. Let's face it. Arthur Blank has the capability. And he has the technology. So why didn't he do it? Because losing was the plan all along. Exactly. Lest we forget. Arthur Blank is a billionaire. And if billionaires understand anything, it's simple economics. He supplied a loss, so... We demand a win. Clearly, as the supplies of a loss increase, the demand for a win increases. Thus, ticket sales skyrocket. Think I'm full of it? It's the exact same business model he used for his other highly successful ownership, Home Depot. As the supply of terrible customer service increases, your demand to do everything in yourself increases. That's true. Every time I go to Home Depot, I buy a bunch of stuff that I don't need. And then I spend like five trips going back to buy the stuff that I actually do need. And on every one of those trips, I buy more stuff that I didn't need all over again. This man is a genius. Their slogan is literally, you can do it, we can't help. If you don't think about it, it all makes sense. Hey guys, thanks for watching. We're gonna be doing tributes all season, so if you like what you see, be sure to hit the subscribe button. And don't be selfish, share.